Time Warner Cable's Local Edition. My name is Brad Pomerantz, and we are joined by Alfred Fryho. He is the president of Honor PAC, which is what? Honor PAC is a political action committee that um, works to empower Latino, Latina, uh, LGBT candidates uh, and support them to higher office. You must be very excited because over the last few years, we've seen LGBT Latinos do quite well. The Speaker of the California State Assembly, John Perez, mm -hmm. is a gay Latino. Uh, Robert Garcia, Vice Mayor of Long Beach. They're mo both aspiring to higher office. That's right. How do you feel about that? Well, we're very excited about it. We think that we played a part in making sure that those progressive candidates got elected to office. Uh, we are very proud of their work. Um, and there are many more candidates um, that are inspired by their leadership that are running for office at the local level. I think about politics in the 80s, the 90s. I don't know if this would have happened back then. Mm -hmm. I mean, I just, I don't feel that. Do you? I mean, I feel like it's a new day. Well, we definitely believe that uh, the discussion around LGBT rights is a, has been a discussion for many decades. But the issue around LGBT Latino Latina rights is a new discourse, and we feel like we're bringing that to the table. It's, a, it's an important uh, opportunity for us to advocate for Latino Latinas who are also part of that, uh, you know, and uh, coalition. I'd be remiss if I didn't mention Ricardo Laura, who is a state senator from the That's Long right. Beach area. I believe he is the chair of the Latino caucus. That's right. Could you imagine a gay Latino being chair of the Latino caucus 20, 30 years ago? Even a few years ago. Right. Um, and Why it's, is this happening? What's going right? Forgive me for saying that, but sure. what's going right? Well, we think that there's greater awareness. Mm -hmm. uh, we think that there's greater opportunities for candidates to pursue higher office. Um, and uh, we're in the middle of that. We're making sure that the discussion continues to be at the forefront of all elected officials. But, but when you look at someone like John Perez, mm -hmm. his status, if that's, if I can use that term, it is so tangential to, to the man. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's just, he's a speaker. <laughs> he's mm -hmm. Mr. Speaker. And that's, that says a lot. Absolutely. I do think that we're moving away from identity mm -hmm. politics. It becomes one of many, um, uh, you know, identity, identities right. rather that inform. The, that's right. right. Uh, the, and that's really the opportunity to have it be one of many and not be necessarily categorized um, as such. Let's talk about an exciting event coming up on March 22nd, the Honor Pack Gala. I can only imagine what fun it will be. Tell us about it. Well, it's our inaugural gala. Oh, it's inaugural. The very first mm -hmm. one. Um, we're doing it at the Japanese American National Museum uh, in downtown LA. Great place for events. Fantastic right. venue. Um, it's our first time that we're going to have really an official celebration of all the victories we've had. We've been around for seven years, mm. and we haven't had this as big an event. Um, right. So we're really enthusiastic about it. We have uh, the Speaker of the Assembly, the new Speaker to be, Tony Atkins, also attending. Right. Um, she is a lesbian herself, not a Latina, but I'm sure uh, um, there's pride there. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. uh, and we've endorsed uh, Tony Atkins, and mm -hmm. uh, she'll be uh, attending and supporting us. The, one of the great things about the event is that we're also having uh, President Obama's inaugural poet, Richard Blanco, oh. joining us is uh, he a that gay man? evening. That's right. I didn't know that. Yes. Yeah. So how did you get him? That's quite a, a coup. Well, we extended the invitation. We told him what we represent and what we do as an organization, and he was really excited about uh, supporting us. Um, he was the first Latino gay poet ever mm. to, of course, participate. And, and I must say, I know you yourself, you are, are you a partner? Yes. At a mm -hmm. major law firm That's in downtown right. Los Angeles 20, 30 years ago, not so sure. That's true. A lot That's of pride. True. You should be very proud of yourself you. as well because there's a lot of success to go around, not just in elective office. His name is Alfred Frejo. He is the president of the Honor Pack. Don't forget the event is on March 22nd, 2014. I'm Brad Pomerantz. It is Time Warner Cable's Local Edition.